In this video I'm going to show you how you can easily turn on or off work focus mode on your iPhone. Be sure to watch the video to the very end so you don't make any mistakes and of course do not forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel. Thanks guys. So let's get started and uh, first off we need to open up control center. To do that just uh, swipe down from the top right corner just like that. It will open up control center and uh, that's where we can easily find uh, this focus shortcut. We can just uh, tap on it to see all the different focus modes and uh, then all we have to do in order to activate work focus mode is just uh, tap where it says work that will highlight that button and uh, that means that work focus mode is now active. So we can go out of control center for now. As you can see work focus mode icon appears uh, right here next to time widget and um, let me show you one more trick. We can right from here hit at these three dots and uh, then we can activate work focus mode for one hour until uh, this evening and until I leave uh, this location. Also we can get into settings and uh, that's where we can select the people and uh, the applications from which we will receive notifications during this mode. So if I tap at choose people that will come up with uh, my contacts and then I can check mark some users and hit add done to allow them to be able to call me or send me text message notifications. The same about apps. If we scroll down for a bit we will find customize screen section and that's where we can set custom wallpaper for that focus mode. We can choose a wallpaper for the lock screen and for the home screen. And also we can set a schedule for uh, that focus mode. You can hit where it says add schedule and then you can choose time range, location or active app. If you want to turn off work focus mode you can easily do so right from the control center. All you have to do is just tap at that shortcut and then tap at that work focus mode to deactivate it. That's it. Now you can write down in the comments below if you have any questions about the tutorial. Hit the like button if you like that video and see you in the next one.